I, I'm a lifelong conservative voter. I've occasionally voted for Democrats and third party candidates, but I've tended to vote uh, Republican on the hopes that uh, their claims to their promises of fiscal conservatism would uh, uh, would uh, be fulfilled. Um, uh, little did I know. Um, I think excessive partisanship is a real problem in our country. I, I once asked a relative why she always voted Democrat. She said, well, because I believe in a woman's right to choose. So I asked her, well, if you were faced with a Republican candidate in favor of, of abortion and a Democrat opposed to it, how would you vote? And she said, oh, I'd vote Democrat. I could never vote for a Republican. And I think this is really what the problem is today. I mean, I know so many people from relatives and friends with whom I've you know, mostly agreed on the important things the important things to me over the last several decades, uh, who know that they know in their heart of hearts that Donald Trump is totally unqualified to be president of the United States and that he's a reprehensible human being. Um, they know he lies. They know he's immoral. They know that he breaches every single Judeo-Christian principle and code of ethics. They, they know he never reads the Bible, and when he feigns to pray in public, it's a complete fraud. They know he's ignorant and worse, he's disinterested in learning. They know he cares only about himself. They, they know he has no clue how to solve the U.S. trade deficit problem. They know he really doesn't care one iota about the uh, long-term sustainability of fiscal policy. He's, he's said as much that he's the king of debt. Um, they know he loves to promote discord. And perhaps most importantly, they know that they would oppose virtually everything that he does if President Obama were doing the same thing. And in fact, that's what they did do. They did oppose his playing golf. They, they opposed his uh, executive orders. But if it's Donald Trump, it's okay. So they're going to vote to reelect him because he's not a Democrat. It isn't because they can defend Trump's policies. It isn't because they think that he has any strategies that will work for the long run benefit of the country. It's because he claims to be a Republican. For me, I'm going to vote for Joe Biden, and I would really hope that more Republicans could bring themselves to recognize that our checks and balances can ensure us that a Democrat is hardly going to be the end of the world for us, and Joe Biden really is the better of the two candidates. So I'm hoping that they will, by, by November 3rd this year, see the light. In any case, uh, Joe Biden certainly has my support.